Greetings and salutations, viewer. It is I, Eric J. Chucky. We are playing Final Fantasy VI. And, uh, yeah. This is a really cool part of the game. I, I could say that for literally, like, 90% of this game. And have for some parts of it. So that's the sapia tone means we're having a flashback. It's an esper attack. Let's lo let loose our espers. Wow, you could have translated that less of a fucking alliteration sandwich. years in the past, a battle was waged here. Lord Odin is the only Esper left to us. Has his wounds healed? Has his wounds healed. Have his wounds healed? Has his wound healed? Not has his wounds healed. It matters not. We must leave this final battle in Odin's hands. A city ruined during the War of the Magi. London Sukkot! London Sukkot! Oh, it's a sassy ghost. I believe that's supposed to be an Esper. Impressive. I never thought you'd be able to turn me to stone. There's an ancient legend. It tells of a battle between Odin and a powerful sorcerer. Oh, wasn't even a, wasn't even an Esper. It's a sorcerer. It took place in a great hall of the castle. So, you get that information no matter who you bring down here. Um, there are a couple of extra tidbits of dial- Oh, I forgot you had the curse shield on. It's, it's been uh, a little while since I played. Um, as usual, I only have so much time to record these episodes, and I do like doing other shit. <sighs> um... But yeah, you, you get that little play out no matter who you bring down here. And I think it's just whoever's at the front of your party that tells the story, as it were. Uh, Tara gives you a couple little extra bits of dialogue, so I brought her. Um, and I like to think that it makes more sense if Tara tells you what happened, because maybe she's like feeling the Esper vibe and like reading it. Strago, I think, would also make sense. Uh, because he's Strago, he knows shit about the past. But like, we could have had Gao up there in front, and he would have been like, "Wow, this what happened." We're getting gunked. My hair has grown enough since the last time I recorded, and my headphones feel weird. Ooh, that did not do shit. Let's just hit him. Quit gunking.
Uh, but I, I like this place because it, it really feels like... Uh, the Punisher is in that treasure chest. Don't worry, Daredevil is across the hall. No. Uh, Punisher is a rod that draws MP from its wielder to deal critical, so it's a lot like the Enhancer sword. Um, yeah, we got MP. Let's just... Plythana. Uh, there we go. Yeah, it's a lot like that. So it's it's going to give you something that makes your mage characters... Actually, what the fuck is the point of that? Because your mage character is going to be using their MP for magic. Uh, I guess when you have to hit. Is this it? Yeah, fucking random encounter. From Armored Woman. Oh man, I hope he's not tough. Things with that sprite are usually kind of tough. Let's, let's straight cat it up here. Uh, can we suplex it? Yes, we can. Ooh, we need to do some heals. Look at the sensor. But yeah, um, I, I remember a lot of the fan theories when I was young and going through the forums uh, and all that such. Diffuser, I always thought was a cool looking attack. Um, or that this was Baron Castle from Final Fantasy IV. Oh, he just straight up dead. Arise! Arise, Sitsa, arise! Boy, this child is kicking our asses. That is not what you want on, on your chicken sandwich. Oh, I put it in wrong. Oh, another diffuser. I think we might be fucking dead. Yeah, terrible. Which is honestly fine, because she's got the, the countdown, so that should be going now, yes. Now, no, not the all-hitting missile, please. Okay, just don't save it, that's fine. Uh, you also do the curing. You also do the curing. Yeah, we'll do the cat scratching. I don't know why I was fucking around with Meteor Suplex when, um, Bum Rush is a thing. But here we go. There we go. Everybody has some hit points. Everybody loses some hit points. Oh my god. Oh, we have Kiraga. Man, I'm just not used to having good spells and good attacks and shit. Yeah, it's dead. Holy shit, what a wandering monster. I'm sure it didn't help that our rows were switched. Save and learn. Trent Resonor did it. Oh, that was dumb of me. I am a goddamn stupid. We we might be going back to. Uh, yeah, you helped too. Yep. Mm, shockwave, huh? What are you shockwaving? Okay, that's fine. Wow. All right. So. <laughs> That got a little, uh... <laughs> Oof! I just got my hair to stand up there. Feeling it, you know? Jesus. I knew that was there. Like, that's why I talked about the random encounter being humorous, because I knew that fucker was in the box. Jesus. What does I say every time I play one of these games? Like, when I get started, what did we do? Power up. Don't... What's the S for me? But I got one down? Yeah, but I got one down. Oh, we're missing. Oh, shit. Okay. Uh, what else do you have? You have Mig or Sormer. Let's see it. Nice. That did some damage. What do you have? Bismarck? Fuck it. Do you think this Abyssal Maw. What a fucking name. Good thing I'm not monetized because. Jesus, all the swear. Breach Blast! I think you could put a little bouncy ball in there. Like a 1 in a 100 chance. Those are all just pretty bouncy balls. and call it Breach Blast. Maybe have a nice musical sting. Gao is stuck doing some shit. Uh, you are going to have to bring Terra back as she is dead Yep, yeah, thanks, Death. 
actually like full fucking health. That's that's some, that's some new shit. Cure. Let's just no. Let's cure everybody. <laughs> These games are so fun and so tense when you're actually like doing shit. That's gonna fucking hurt. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, gal. Hmm. Oh, I wish you would stop. Mm -hmm. Jeez, increasing. Okay. Alright, let's get Terra back up first. Because she's got the magic that will heal us best. He, please get up, not Katon. God damn it. Mm. Oh, it didn't do any damage to save it. I'll take that. There we go. Just attack Gao or something. Nope. Okay. Fuck you. Oh, what what I wouldn't do for a Phoenix Esper right now. And honestly, I think Gao has the Phoenix Esper. But... Jesus! Oh, just chill for a second, my guy. What if you just chilled for a second? No. Fuck. <sighs> oh. We fucking died, guys. Guys, we fucking died. Guys, do you believe it? We fucking died. Mmm. 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 That stings. Right in the clavicle. Okay. Well, we kept our experience. Setzer kept that level he got. I'm gonna have to push an A button through this shit for a second. I could just speed the ROM up, but... No. Um... While all this is going on, uh, yeah, a lot of people back in the day thought this was like Baron Castle from Final Fantasy IV, uh, because, as I've said a thousand times, this was Final Fantasy III and Final Fantasy IV was Final Fantasy II, so we thought it was a direct tie back. Um, we had no idea about Gogo -Go being a character in Final Fantasy V, so, you know, that wasn't talked about as much. Most people thought Gogo -Go was somebody. Uh, did I get into that? I don't remember, and I'm not going to stop this video to watch another video to find out. Uh, a lot of people thought Gogo -Go was Daryl, um, Setzer's ex. Um, a lot of people thought Gogo -Go was the Emperor, who had lost his mind uh, after the fall of the world. Um, a lot of people thought Gogo -Go was... Uh, some people thought Gogo -Go was General Leo. Really, Daryl was the big one. Um, and then somebody online, on the Final Fantasy Online forums um, that I used to frequent back in the day, or Eyes on Final Fantasy or something like that, uh, one of the two, um, either started or perpetuated this rumor that it was a weird reference to an American politician whose name escapes me off the top of my head. I want to say Abe Bogota, but no, that's an actor. Um, Yeah, I, I don't remember off the top of my head. You, you can look it up. American politician go go. I'm sure you'll find it. Uh, they had all these like totally real reasons that were totally actually real things. That it was it was the virgin days of the internet in, in terms of public consumption. So you couldn't just look it up and go, no, it wasn't. Uh, but in truth, go go is go go. Yeah, that's it. Um, so we, I mean, you know, anybody who consumes media has a tendency to like to look for connections that aren't really there. You know, it's fun. It's fun to think about how things tie together. I mean, it's the same way for me. You know, can I can I say 100% that Edgar is intended to be the the responsible adult, the the straight man, if you, if you will, of the um, 
of the party. No. You know, maybe they just didn't have enough time to write a really, you know, character-changing story for it. Or maybe they didn't think it was important. Or maybe they thought they did and they just fucking didn't. I don't know. It's what I like to think. Um, I think it makes everything feel a little more well-rounded. I think it makes, you know... It makes everyone feel more three-dimensional, because not everybody has damage, you know? Or not everybody handles it poorly. I'm sure Edgar was sad about his dad and his brother leaving, but he was the bigger man. He, he did what had to be done, you know? And, and I, I can't say that the, the writers, as many of them as there were, had any intention of trying to convey any of that shit. It's just what I like to think. So in that vein, a lot of people had a lot of questions about this place, and I remember the first time I came to it, even though the game, like, points you to it, I felt like I'd stumbled across the secret. It, you know, the music being so... Look at this shit. They kept Suriander. Do you have things? Oh, you got Bob. Uh, let's stick with Stray Cat because magic damage is like shit. And you're an imp! Anyway, no, you got a ribbon. That's right. Ugh, just you bitch about one thing at a time. Um... So Suriander is dead now, but was a big frog with a bunch of bubbles on its back. There's a kind of toad, um, and if you have any of that, uh, I forget the name of it, but that, that phobia of little tiny holes, don't Google this. It is a little bit gross, even for me. Um, I did a lot of exposure therapy with stuff like that, just so I could get over it, because it really wigged me out when I was young, and I was tired of it being something I was susceptible to. And this was one of the things I looked at. Uh... Yeah, Suriname toad are toads from Suriname, go figure. Um, that keep their young in little flesh pouches on their back. Um, until they're ready to, you know, go be toads on their own. Obviously, that's what that's referencing. I don't know why they didn't fix it in this translation. Like, <sighs> okay, I, this is obviously a huge project. I'd say I couldn't do it, but I could. There's there's modding utilities out there. People have set me up to be able to do this. God, I'd have fun doing it. Um, and they've done a lot of good stuff in a lot of... in conveying a lot of things, um, as was originally intended. But then there's shit like saying Crescent Island is Triangle Island, or... We always have those. Let's just use some of those. Or choosing not to fix certain stuff. Uh, we need more people with good spells. Please put on Phoenix. And then if everyone fucking dies, at least I can... Yeah, I can bring them back. I don't know if those two fights we had before, three, count toward the, the Cursed Shield still. I don't know if that transfers or not. It's not like I've been keeping track anyway, so it is what it is. It's, um... Yeah, I, I don't quite understand the priorities of this. And maybe this part isn't done yet. I don't know. Maybe people just like the name Suriander. I haven't been... I've never really known where to look for online communities. Um, alright, let's make sure we're ready for this shit. You know what, we also need Golem out here. Who, who do you have? Bismarck? Why do you have Bismarck? The Vigor Bones, okay. We can live with Golem here for a second. I don't think you're gonna level up from this. Oh, it's possible. Okay. Monster. Let's let's cat rage. You Kiraga us. And you go. Let's stick the blitz. And 
why don't you arise yourself? Because that countdown, that doom is going to tick over. Oh shit, so now regular attacks aren't going to hit him. But what about the Blitz? Oh, I forgot about that for Gal. God damn it. Miss? Does Ribbon prevent a rise? I cast a rise and not lose. This is fucking life two, life three. Do that shit to me. God damn it. Uh, you do some magic here. I'm a ball. Well, at least we're getting it in right before she fucking dies. Thank you, and if you would come back, please. Your magic. Okay, we're, we're still hit, so that's good. You can cast your rock. There we go. If Katon doesn't kill you, it sure fucking did. So much for that. Who's doing- No, don't do that! Aw, oh, you shit. Now he's not doing his fucking physical attacks. Rise on Sensor. Which, that's the actual spell we wanted to use. Yeah, we need more people with that magic. Right? Don't hit Terra, thank you. Oh yeah, we still got Golem. We're alright, we can do this. I believe in this, guys. You attack. I hope y'all weren't super dedicated to my train of thought from before because I have lost it. <laughs> oh! Final Fantasy Community. So, I kind of stopped looking for them like a long time ago. Yeah, I kicked his ass too on top of it. I just didn't. You know, the games I cared about were being pushed out. Um, it was like, you know, on the message form, Master Scroll, what we're down here for. That's going to give us license to get a couple of other things. We're going to put it on sensor for now. Yes, I know the Hyper Wrist is really good, but... We will take the lesser damage for what this does. Proof of a Warrior's Mastery, Bearer attacks four times. We also have the Genji Gloves on it. No, put darts on it. No, that's a little better, but I, I want you to attack from the back row. Ugh. You know what? That was a hard enough fight. Let's go save. Let's go save and use a tent. Just went on to live through that again. Because there's other hard fights in here. Uh, Stray Cat. Just attack. Attack and should be. Um, yeah, you saw that. I should have I had Setzer go alone. But here we go. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Eat a dick. So much like when you cast a spell on all targets, um, it does reduce damage, but he, he'll just go hand and attack whoever. It's real sexy. Uh, so yeah, um, the Final Fantasy forums I went to, which I want to say were eyes on Final Fantasy. Um, Final Fantasy Online was another one. I think I checked them out briefly, but I was a little cocksure shit at the time, so I forcibly alienated myself from that place. I don't know. Um, and now it's all about Reddits, and I'm on the Final Fantasy Reddit, but big surprise, everyone wants to talk about Final Fantasy VII Remake right now. Let's uh, hold off and watch Setzer kick some ass here. Let's see what he can do. Saban obviously I already go, so. But Setzer, do your thing. Oh! I 
Oh, is they could do that? We can't anymore. He's fucking dead. Uh, but that's why I've been trying to get Setzer's Vigor up. Oh, and in fact, duh, let's go replace that Esper real quick. Bismarck. There's not a guy with better strength boosts, right? I haven't forgotten. Yep, it's Bismarck. Okay. And comparatively speaking, he's at a 40, Saban's at a 91. But I believe Saban has a hyper wrist. Man, that's some good beer. Okay, let's go on the cast problem. Uh. So yeah, they, the discussion on the game got less and less. At this point, I'm not really sure where people talk about it. I would guess... Jesus, that crit! Uh, I would guess a Discord somewhere, maybe. Um, and, and, I don't know, maybe that's where they've been talking about it for a while now. It seems like there's a lot of, like, people talk about the Final Fantasy VI community as though it's a big, strong thing. I don't know where to find it. I would love to participate in it, but I don't know where it's located. Okay. So that's again just in time we did that. How nice. Um, no, you heal thyself. So that brings him up to 42 vigor. We're getting there. Not quite so swole as Sabin, of course, but... Okay, so here we go. Odin turned into a Magicite Shard. So, Odin, what are you doing? Speed plus one, and he teaches Meteor at a times one rate. So speed plus one, if you're playing Locke, that's who you want to slap on Locke. Um, there are some secrets, and we're going to explore them. There's one thing we are not going to do right away. Is there a treasure over here? Maybe not. But yes, B is what increases um, Locke's steel success rate, so rest assured that when Locke is in the party, we will be having Odin on him for level ups. There's that armored weapon again. Maybe this fight will go a little better with him, with everybody being in the proper row. Yeah, it's taking a big hit. Well, I mean, the hyper wrist is often too. Uh, and the Genji Glove part is fun, but if you just equip like a hyper wrist in an offering. In fact, let's check that out. We'll, we'll do that after this fight. Because if you got a character like Saban, it might be worth it. And it's definitely cool. But I, I would like a little more efficiency, just in this scenario. So let's let's put on that hyper wrist. There it is. And what are we looking at? That's a pretty big difference. For the Gladius. Let's let's see how he go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Back to the front. If we're gonna use the Gladius. Gladius, Gladius. Gladiolus. Alright. So without the Genji Glow, we get four attacks. Oh, but look at the strength! Not bad. Now, if you've got someone who's high enough strength, you know, like I said, it, it's 
it behooves you to just go ahead and let them have the Genji Glove and the Offering. But, the Offering, the Master Scroll, the Offering back in the day, and so the term Genji Glove Offering is like cemented in my head. Oh, learn Firaga. Not that we're going to use it much, because your magic power kind of sucks. Oh, just in time. Uh, Poison. Didn't realize he was so low. Holy shit. There, now everyone is better. Ah, here's a room. A treasure. Yeah, that's what I wanted to do with my directions. Blizzard orb and a gold hairpin. Wow, another one? For real? There's a death chair. Yep, another gold hairpin. And is that a second blizzard orb? Where are you? How now? No, I don't think we had the blizzard orb before. Dark swirling orb that absorbs ice damage. Equip on a yeti. I don't think he's already got that. Um, it, it allows him to do a big magical attack called Blizzard. Uh. <sighs> yeah, that's pretty fucking sick right there. Um, it also applies on hit effects, so let's... Equip him with the Death Tarot and put him back in the back row. So, here's this a book with a gem encrusted cover. Why is that formatted that way? Queen's Diary. I realize now that I'm in love with Odin. This breaks every rule of our society, but my heart longs for this noble, elegant man. How could anyone blame me? After the fighting's over, I'm going to bear my soul to him. Love between a human and an esper. That's it. That's what you get. That's the whole line. It's the whole reason we brought Terra down here. We got an X Ether. I know it's not much, but, you know. Hey. There's supposed to be something you read. Maybe I need to go check for it again. Let's kill his armored weapon real fast before he diffuses delightful aromas through our house. Ah, uh, but yeah, I didn't realize how big mods were, um, and, and hacking and all that shit in Final Fantasy VI, because I've been apart from wherever the fuck the Final Fantasy community is. Oh, Death Tarot is just not doing any damage. Does it not increase damage from the back row? Is that why Setzer's been sucking this whole time? We about to put some egg on my fucking face? Uh, your hit points are okay. I mean, you know all that, you know all that. Oh, Muhammad, that's not bad. Oh, we don't need that yet. What is it, meteor? Yeah. Uh, how are you doing? Oh, you already know, Flair. Oh, we're just getting you hit points out the ass. Okay. You can be faster. Fuck it. That'll also affect his, uh, his little gauge going up. So, yeah, you take the Bahamut. And you're stuck on Bismarck. You, my friend, still on Phoenix. Uh, let's get this guy's ass in the front row again. Let's... Jesus, if it were that simple, man... Find that. Alright, 
I don't know off the top of my head, but... We're just gonna do it the way we know how. I don't recall the number of steps, but... There we go. I wasn't even paying attention to that damage to see if it was better. Uh, good, he'll have another chance. Okay, so it's a little better. So yeah, the back row was fucking him up this whole fucking time. My face, she is covered in me. Rise and Kiraga, good. It's just always good to have backup healers in a party. You know, as much as I was trying to be like, no, I'm not teaching everybody every magic. Uh, healing magic? Alright, well, I guess let's get that fucking Gladius back on you, my guy. Oh, that's wild. Okay. Oh, and you need heal. Now there's a stairway down here. So I, I forget where we find that out. Who we talk to. Um, I thought it was in here, but maybe I missed it. It's been a really long time, and this is... Uh, like I said before, I remember the beginning of the game really well. Because, you know, I played it a whole bunch more than I played the end of the game. Because you start a game, and then you're like, eh, I don't want to do it. I want to do it differently or whatever. Um, so I just can't remember off the top of my head. And it's not... There's no point in looking it up, because I fucking know where it is. Alright, uh, here's what we're down here to fight. Woof. Uh, let's just stick a straight to it. Let's see what kind of damage this does. Enough! Hmm, could have used that golem. I'm gonna go ahead and hit Kira on us. And then we're gonna hit Kiraga with her. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I really could have used Golem here. Mistakes were made. Uh, I don't know if I hit that Blitz right. That was ugly. We got, what, the Bismarck back on him? Yeah. Um, okay, well, we've got... Protect, we can cast that. You have Mahamut, let's go ahead and use him, that'll be cool. Sabin learns a rise, so we don't really need to worry about that at this point. About re raising Terra. A little protection for Setzer. Mega Flare. Go ahead and protect uh, Gal. That is fine. Oh, another tsunami. Mm, Sabin no, might not survive this. Let's go ahead and hit Kira. Nope, she's down. Sabin's probably going to be down before we can do jack shit about it. That's frustrating. Oh, cool, we killed him. So Terra doesn't get the experience or whatever from it, but that's okay. Terra's pretty high level. Zantatsukin and 10 points. So that's Saving Sword. Um, let's just go ahead and Phoenix down. And she can do. Yeah, she's almost level 40. People's getting up there. Alright, 
so that's the queen. She's also petrified. Yes, it's just Maria's sprite that they reused. Why do the Maria and Queen sprites share the same sprite when Katarin has her own unique sprite? I don't fucking know. I don't fucking know. Um... So... I don't know if the patch fixes this, but I'm not invested enough to give a shit. Even the queen was turned to stone. A tear comes from the stone. The Magicite Odin gains a level and becomes the Magicite Right. Which, I mean, doesn't make any fucking sense, but whatever. Quick. Ah, oh, level up speed too, so this patch does fix it. That makes it even better, actually. I don't know where else we can learn Meteor. I'm probably forgetting someone. But, uh, yeah, speed plus two, so your lock can get even better. I believe usually um, Raiden still teaches you quick, which is one hell of a spell uh, at times one. Um, but it doesn't give you a bonus of speed. So you kind of want to come down here and grab Odin and then go wander around and then come back and change him. Or just never change him. Um, I didn't show off the Odin summon. He, well, you know, a combination of things I'll show you here in a second. You saw a little tiny version of his sprite um, just a moment ago when he was fighting, twice actually in this episode, when he was fighting the um, other dudes that are in the cutscene. Um, and it roughly looks like this, Shin Zantetsuken. Yep, except he had the other sprite in the before. And that's what happens. Cool, huh? So now we have him, um, and we have... If you have someone with enough MP, especially someone who doesn't heal, like, I don't know, Gal, um... Parity range, so we gotta go to the Swords. Is that not a... Oh no, it's a two-handed weapon. May randomly dispatch an enemy in one hit. Oh, Cyan can use it, though. Okay, that's why I thought that. Sexy. Alright, well, let's get the fuck out of here. In fact... You don't have warp. I mean, you don't have warp. You don't have warp. And you don't have warp, so we're walking out. Oh well. Uh, it's not that long a walk. Look, we get to use a tent. Checking my text messages during a playthrough uh, of a video game, like a real professional. But you know what? I'm pretty sure the person who is texting me is the only fucking person watching this. So, I'm sure they won't mind. And if you're somebody who didn't text me and you're watching this, let me know in the comments section, because... I was just casually dissing out that kind of damage. That's so insane. Oops. So yeah, uh, I, I like that area a lot. I think it's pretty cool. Um, I'm glad we went to it. We've got some other shit to do now. Bam, look at all that. Power right there, my guy. 
So that's a gain to level, so we got some more vigor, so he's going to be even stronger. So that when we actually end up using him for the final battle, it will be, um... Well, the final dungeon anyway, I don't know if we did the final battle. I got zapped. Thinking ahead, I know what I want to do immediately next. And I know what I want to do after that. But who all am I going to take with me? We need someone to continue to break the curse on the cursed shield. Um, because you know what? I, I just haven't used it in a long time. And I think that would be neat. Not Terra, though. She's so high level. I mean, not like... Like, theoretically, we could go another 50? 5 plus 4 plus... Yeah, 9. 59 levels, and it wouldn't be a big deal. But I don't want to be that strong. I don't want to mow through everything. I like the challenge. Like I was saying earlier, when this game is challenging, it's really fucking fun. Just having to juggle everything, having to keep track of, you know, what your characters can do and what they can't do. And... You know, timing everything properly and all that shit. It's just, it's fun. That is what makes this battle system engaging and entertaining, is when you actually have to pay attention and try. Unlike me right now, who's just letting Saban die, because fuck it. My actions have no consequences, what do you expect from me? No, I just... I believe we could get out of here. Level 5 death might kill some motherfuckers. Nope. Terra's not quite 50 yet. Or 40. That level 5 death would have worked, because... You know, it would now she's 40. Back to Figaro. Do, 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 do. Continuing. Which, honestly speaking, I mean, if you don't use Figaro Castle to go under the ground, and you don't have to, you know, this was part of me making my own stories and you know, wandering around the world and whatnot, um, you would not stumble across that area. Okay, okay. So it, it, it does remain a kind of a secret. But we had a tendency to find out our own secrets back in those days. Koopa-po-po-po-po-po-po. Okay, we want Shadow with us. This is a badass. Go ahead and grab Go Go. Let's see. Yeah, we're done with Terra. Um, unless I don't think there's anything I need her for. So in that sense, I don't think I'm going to use her again before the final battle. Uh, Lock can suck the fuck. Uh, Morrow could use some levelage. Mog could use some levelage. Realm's probably not going with us. So Edgar, Cyan, Locke. A little bit Celeste. Celeste might be the one who ends up carrying our shield. Uh, that is not what's going on right now, though. Yes, uh... All that, whatever. So... Umaro. Yeah, he's got a Berserk Ring and Hermes Shoe. Give him the Blizzard Roll. Increases his magic. Um, he absorbs ice damage instead of just fire damage or whatever. So that wouldn't be too bad. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. Fuck it, let's do it. Look at his face. 
Nope. I'm stuck. Uh, let's give him Genji Glows. Let's give him the Master Scroll. There we go. Sure, that's fine. Uh, I don't think you need something like this, but just in case, let's give you Bismarck. <laughs> Everyone else can stay on equip for the time being. We are going to go do a little bit of betting at Le Colosseum. We'll save first, too. Man, that uh, ended up taking a lot longer than I thought because of that restart. Okay, yes, I would love to fight in the Colosseum. And we are going to bet this here Impartisan to get a cat ear hood. Crude crescent shaped fishing spear used by imps. Okay. To the were dragon. Neat. We're gonna use shadow. And uh, hope it goes well, basically. Because you don't control what goes on. If you remember. Cool. Done. So far so good. Let's bet that cat ear hood. What do you get for that? Doubles the gill obtained after battle. That's kind of cool. We've got to fight a slag worm. That's rough. Nope, we deflected it because we're too fucking good. Oh, oh, that armor. Oh, Jesus, he's very strong. Just, just wail on Shadow. Oh, sandstorm. That's a bad spell. Oh, that's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt. Look at all that damage. No, not another sandstorm. Do less damage. You can cast protect. This is the kind of shenanigans you can get up to. This fight, you doof. Protect ain't gonna protect you. No, you're fucking dead. You lost us our cat ear hood. That is how that works, right? It's gone now, yeah? Yep, there it's gone. Well, boo. <sighs> I might do this off screen. I don't know. I'll just go to the end here. Here, you talk to me. Oh, handy. Yahoo! We did it, Clyde! A million gil. What a blast. I love this. Guess it's time to change our name. Our name. We need something more appropriate. Such as... Shadow. Not bad, huh? Great train robbers of the century. Shadow. So Clyde is Shadow. Hmm. Ah, good. Kill it all again. Okay, well, that was frustrating. The item I want to get would make Gogo -Go a lot better. Need another impartisan. Um, hmm. yeah. let's unequip everybody and let's set up a new.
Okay. Let's uh, tackle the people who are kind of low right now. Cyan. Edgar. Who else is only like 34? Nog. Locke. Those be Nog. Locke, you suck, so... Uh, you can have the shit shield. Curse shield, there we go. Give him his relics. No, he needs a ribbon. So I'm not all that worried about Mug, so we'll probably take that good weapon off of him. Uh, Thief Bracer. Increases steel success rate. Is there anything that makes his speed or win edge? Cool. I'll leave him with the win edge. Uh, let's, of course, give him also. Right, we need to get that speed up some more. Uh, Mog, we want magical, and that makes sense for his dances. Uh, hit points wouldn't go up miss either. Hmm, Zona Seeker, yeah. Edgar, we like to end strengthen. What about Phoenix? Yeah, let's not worry about his stats for a second. It's Phoenix and not. You can get all Bahamuti. Marakumo. That's good. That's good. Royal Crown. Oh, that's way better, though. Let's give Cyan the Force Shield. Hmm, Circle's really good there, too. Red Cap's really good there, too. He's got the red jacket. Let's give him the Force Armor. Did I equip him? No, I did not. Uh, Relics. Mog. Yeah, white cape. That sounds good. Um, not the Mortal Charm. Uh, prayer beads? Better evade? We often have Dragoon boots and stuff on him so he can do that thing, but I don't know. Fuss with it. Um, you know what? Let's give him a gold hairpin. No, no, that's wasteful too. Is there anything that increases magic? Yes. Barrier ring, fine. Uh, you can have. A Zephyr cloak, sure, why not? Hyper wrist, sure. Cyan can have the Master Scroll and also a Hyper wrist. Yes. So let's check that shit out. First things first. I thought we were already there. Um, well, let's see if we can go steal a partisan real quick. Or an partisan. Let's steal a couple. I won't take up too much of your time. It's uh, let's say ten minutes tops. We are looking for those mantids again. I don't know if you guys remember when we stole this in the first place. Mm, not terrible damage. No, I guess it's not bad. Edgar's doing okay. Good and steal. What else is there? Thank you, friendly <laughs> cockatrice. <laughs> what the fuck? 
I see that and I expect he's gonna, you know, turn from the stone. Oh, he just came out of the sky and bopped a motherfucker. Alright. Cool! Petrified Cyan! That's exactly what we wanted. That's what fucking petrifying looks like. Sun Bath? That's cool. That's a healing spell. Cyan don't get any of that. He's fucking petrified. Watch uh, Edgar attack. We can see what that Xantatsuka looks like, I believe. Yeah, it's fucking sick, isn't it? Another Wind Slash. That should take care of him, honestly. I don't know why he had so many more hit points than the other guys. Oh, a whole magic point. Delightful. Lock almost died. We'll have to take one. Uh, I don't know if you all noticed, but uh, now the overworld music, instead of being that sad-ass stuff it was in the first place, is, um... You know what? Lock these. For me. There you go. Uh, it's the airship music. It's the fun, happy airship music. Um, that happened back when we got an airship, because it was like the symbol of a new hope. Okay, just about to kill that guy. That's fine. Cyan, my man. That, okay, he's gone. So what is what is the offering doing for us, the Master Scroll, compared to like a level 1 Ushido? Come back down, you tit. <sighs> okay. That was okay. Um, so yeah, I guess, uh... Master Scroll's kind of wasted on my guy here. Um, let's... Fuck, what's better? Uh, Black Belt? You think? Slap a Growth Egg on him. Level him up a little bit. You know, we, uh, I'm gonna block needs the... Ribbon for the Curse Shield. I don't want to fuck over right here. Yeah, let's, let's do that. It's Growth Egg. Let's get him to more levels. Hey! There's fucking two of them. Great. Of course you couldn't. You shit. Stale. Yeah, we got an impartism. Alright, that one can fucking die. Can't do Bushido, don't want to risk him killing the wrong. Whoa, I forgot how hard these things hit. Yeah, do that. Come on, Lock, get it together. Oh my god, you're gonna make me res you, aren't you? You, you bitch. Cool. Stupid deadlock. That soft musical noise is one of my cats. One of my cat-o-friendos. 
Um, he could steal. He's very talented. Clever boy. Much better than Monk. Ultimately a low bar. Jesus. Uh, heal yourself, my friend. Steal yourself, my other friend. Cool. Oh, he was already max hit points. I forgot how low we were. Um, I could really use, like, an Arise right now. And a lot less cat aggro, buddy! Cats don't understand what recording videos for the internet is. Unless they're, like, being the ones recorded. Oh my god, Locke, you piece of shit. Mind Reaper. Cool, thanks. Do that more. He just wants some love. Love and attention. He just scratch his nose. You know what? If you're gonna show up at any time, it's this one. I'm standing here fighting mantids. Yay! We did it! Yay! Fucking mom died again. Let's chainsaw this little bitch. No, ouch. Oh, oh, you lived through it. I see. I see how it is. Nice. Gotta use a fucking tent after one battle with mantids. Holy shit. Ugh, all right. Um... fight them again for a little bit. We've got two uh, for the next time, just in case we fuck up. But we're gonna need someone who's crazy strong. Um, I could maybe do... Oh, Gogo's not crazy strong. It's a tough one. So if I did Gogo, I could just tell him to fight, and Gogo would be able to... You know... Only do that. You know, I could give him, I could give Gogo just the commands to, to to use the you know the abilities I want to be used instead of random ass magic. Could have saved Scum, but you know. Okay, it's the Opera House. Shriek, help, help! Talk to the impresario. We spelled out the word shriek instead of actually shrieking, but here we are. A dragon is sitting smack in the middle of the stage! I don't even remember what your voice is anymore. So, I told you guys there were some cool, stupid levers up in this room over here, right? Don't press the wrong switch, or... Watch me press the right one. Right away. Of course I do. That's alright, we'll play with the other one here in a second. Right after I teach this dragon what the meaning of pain is. Should have had float on when we get in here. Does anyone actually know float? Oh my god. Locke's dead, so there's that. Do you know? No, you don't know shit. Just fucking heal us, man. Do you know Float? Nope, sure doesn't. I've got the smuggest cat in my arms right now. Just wanted to be held in. It's hard to do when I'm playing a video game, buddy. But he's happy. I think I just cured one person. Locks aren't dead again. He, he might be fucked. Oh, you don't even dance. You don't even do the dance. Mm, nope, that's death. Cyan's the only one left. That's not happening. I'm just going Bushido. Whatever. We have died a lot this episode. 
the episode with all the deaths, deaths they would call this if it were friends. But it's not friends. Just gently whittling away at me. There we go. There was me all arrogant about kicking that dragon's ass, and my ass was the one that got kicked. Only partially due to cat aggro. Yep. Okay, yes, I died. Thank you. So does Locke have float? I remember Locke had a lot of magic. Yes. If I were being extra careful, I would slap the uh, angel feathers or whatever it is on everybody. Uh, because then the float couldn't be dispelled. I'm sure the dragon's got something that dispels the float, but uh, whatever. Alright. That's the switch from before that opened the door. This one turns out all the lights. That's funny. Back when there was an opera for us to save, that mattered. That one barks. And I guess it's barking scared away the cat. So, back to the battle. Let's go ahead and drop Bahamut on him. Did he steal anything? Didn't have anything? I don't remember. Let's fight. Um, Raiden won't do anything here. So there's no sense using him. Yeah, Zona Seeker, why not? That'll be able to give us a little bit of help. What do you have? Just use the drill. Yep, 50 Gs. There it is. But Locke has Float now, and we know that, so we can get him to uh, cast Float again. about to go down. Oh, oh, you, you shit. Let's see if you can get another float off. All right, we're Rhapsody. Memories of better times than as though we weren't on this uh, opera stage and sit somewhere in a field. Part of me wonders if this geomancy stuff wasn't what was planned for Setzer's, Setzer's, Strago's wife. And, um, you have raised, raised Locke. Thank you, Locke, you did something useful. Really appreciate it. Cat, my guys. He is desperate for attention. Oh, that's yeah, okay. uh, float yourself, I guess. Use your bushido. Magnitude eight. Probably lock his dead. Just on him. Get a little wind 
slash for the dragon. Lock can't float himself. Ooh! That was a hit. Let's get a cure on Mog, too. Drill. Uh, oh, and Sunbath. That's awesome. Let's hit Steel. Maybe, maybe he did it. Something to Steel, and we just failed. 50 Gs. Of course. You know what? That's fine. Oh, we killed him! Oh, perfect timing. Perfect fucking timing. Okay, ten magic points. Everybody's gonna learn some spells, I feel. Oh no, just Mog, okay. Get a Magus Rod. Looks like we're gonna have to save the day once again. Yep, your opera got interrupted, alright. And I turned off all the lights. Okay. I think there's just the two major things and a little story thing to do left. And of course trying to get that in part of it. But I tell you what, my ass gonna save has gone that. Let's let's go over here. I'm gonna save it over here. And uh, I will in the downtime try to get us that way. Obviously I'll have to do some party switching, so you might come back and we'll have a completely different group, but um just you got a visual indicator of where we were and what we were doing. There you have it. We're going to go into the Coliseum. We're going to try to make go, go, go. So, uh, thank you guys for watching, even all the cat aggro and deaths. Um, and I hope you will join me again in the next video. Until then, white out.